It's very simple. Dedicate yourself, pray, read Quran, do ibadah, mashallah. Great blessings. You hear one of the one day, one day of etikaf equals makes you so far from Jahannam as far as the earth is from the sky. A lot of blessings. All right. Second point is those of us who cannot, the brothers who want to stay in the masjid and you cannot, you don't have the time to spend the full 10 days and 10 nights. Mashallah. At least you could spend some time. If your job does not allow you to, then maybe you spend a couple of hours in the night. See what I'm saying? And if, you, if, if, if your job allows you to, then maybe in the day you spend a couple of hours. You can say, okay, I'll go in the masjid and stay from Fajr to, to Zohar. Now that will not be the Sunnah Muakadah Etikaf. Nobody's saying that. Hear what I'm saying? I'm not telling you that's a substitute for the last 10 days. No. I'm saying you just can't do the last 10 days. You just can't do it. Mashallah. But it's Ramadan. It's an opportunity for ibadah. So you can spend going to masjid. From Fajr to Zohar Salah. Or from Zohar to Asir. Or Asir to Maghrib. Whatever. And just make dua. Read Quran. Read Nafil Salah. Spend it in Ibarra. Make that intention. Allah, I cannot do 10 days and 10 nights. But I'm going to dedicate every day to put two hours and just stay in the masjid. And make dua. And read Quran. And read Nafil Salah. Etc. Therein lies blessings. You can do Aitikaf all year. See. All year a person can do Aitikaf. There is something called a Farz Aitikaf though. Farz Aitikaf. What is a Farz Aitikaf? If you make a promise that, Ya Allah, if I pass this examination, Ya Allah, if my wife get, gets pregnant, Ya Allah, if I get this job, whatever, you know what wishes we all need to make, whatever you want, then I will do one day of Aitikaf, subhanAllah. I'll go in the masjid and I'll do one day of Aitikaf. So, that etikaf, if you get that accomplishment, you get that job, you get that wife, you get that child, you get that promotion, then that etikaf becomes compulsory for us. So, the last 10 days of Ramadan is sunnat mu'akida. Then you have what is called mustahab. So, one is farz, one is sunnat mu'akida, and one is mustahab. Virtuous is what I was speaking about just now and reminding myself and you a little bit. Alhamdulillah, mashallah. Whatever time you have available in the night, in the day, go dedicate that time in the masjid. One hour, two hours, whatever it is, feasibility. All right? Time does not permit to get into because those who are interested in getting into it, well, you, and you have questions, please feel free to contact us. There's no need I get into thick questions when it doesn't matter to everybody. That's what's called wasting time. <laughs> who want to do the etikaf when you have questions and answers, feel free to contact us.